Hey guys, just wanted to do a really quick video on how I set up my unit study books and my level books. So at the top I have like my level one books from, you know, like readers. I have level two and three and these are all my chapter books. Bella took this tag off so I have to make a new one. So that's just on there so I remember. But all my like chapter books like our read alouds and things like that are all back there. And then also just um, begin our chapter books too. Then we have like our nature and bug insect insect wouldn't fit so I put bug <laughs> um bin and we've got the human body. This is weather and land uh creations. Again, I couldn't find room to put all that. Animals. Um actually this one goes in here. Space. I don't know why the Toy Story book is in there. I think the girls are in here. And then American History, which is really cool. I like to print off articles and um, put like newspaper articles and just different things about Amer American history, um, like current events and also past uh, events as well. So just want to show you guys real quick a way to store that without doing like the big, huge bins, which I love, but I just don't have space for it. But if I... You know, if I did, I would probably do that system, but this system is working really, really good. Plus, the kids can, like, read the stuff without you guys being on that unit. And then when they're done with it, so you're not looking around. Like, I have, like, a bucket of just books right there. Instead of, like, looking through all that, it's, like, right here. And they know, like, this bucket is just for human body books. So, thank you guys for watching. See you guys soon. Bye-bye.